many of you will be able to get the solution to this but can you uh, prove that the answer you got is correct if you cannot then watch to the end and see how i proved that the answer we got or we are supposed to get is correct welcome back to my channel today we have an amazing bad question to solve so we are asked to find the value of x if 4 to the power of x multiplied by 4 to the power of x is equal to 40. Okay, first recall that a multiplied by a is equal to a squared. Okay, so it means that this is 4 to the power of x multiplied by 4 to the power of x. So this is 4 to the power of x squared is equal to 40. Now let us remember that a to the power of m raised to the power of n is equal to a to the power of m times n. So it means that this is 4 to the power of x times 2, which is 2x, is equal to 40. Now, anytime you are solving a an exponential equation anytime you're solving an equation and your power happens to be your variable the only way to find its value is to introduce log or a length to both sides of the equation so we are going to introduce log to both sides of this equation so we'll have log 4 to the power of 2x is equal to log 40. All right. I want us to remember again that log A raised to the power of B is equal to B multiplied by log A. If this is the first time you are seeing this log A channel, please click the subscription button and turn on your notification bell. So that you don't miss our videos, all right? We upload our videos as often as possible. So tune in at your convenience. There must be something new for you to watch. And give us a thumbs up if you love what we are doing. Okay. Now, applying the law that I just explained, it simply means that this becomes, this 2x will come down to multiply log 4. And this will be equal to log 40. Now remember that we are trying to find the value of x. So let's remove any obstacle that will prevent us from having, from having direct contact with x. Okay. So let's divide both sides by log 4. Dividing both sides by log 4. So we'll have 2x multiplied by log 4 divided by log 4 is equal to log 40 divided by log 4. Now log 4 will divide itself 1. 2x times 1 is 2x is equal to log 40 divided by log 4. But 40 is same thing as 10 multiplied by 4. Right? So it means that we can rewrite this as 2x is equal to log 10 multiplied by 4 divided by log 4. All right, remember that log A multiplied by B is equal to log A plus log B, All right? So that means that we can write this as 2x is equal to log 10 plus log 4 divided by log 4. Now, distributing the denominator, 
we will have 2x is equal to log 10 divided by log 4 plus log 4 divided by log 4. So log 4 we divide itself, we have 1. So we have 2x is equal to 1 plus log 10 divided by log 4. Remember that we are going to prove that the answer we got is correct. So I'm trying to simplify this very well so that we can easily prove our solution. Okay. Now also 10 is 2 multiplied by 5 and 4 is 2 squared. So it means that we can write that 2x is equal to 1 plus log 2 multiplied by 5 divided by log 2 squared. I don't know if you can still see that. All right. Now, my, my mic is about to fall off. Okay. Now, let's clean part of this so that we can have enough space to solve it. Now, we have 2x is equal to 1 plus, so applying this law again, the addition law, we will express this as log 2 plus log 5 divided by, then applying the power rule, this 2 will come down to multiply log 2. So we have 2 log 2. I hope you are enjoying this. All right, so now we have 2x is equal to 1 plus, this will give us log 2 divided by 2 log 2 plus log 5 divided by 2 log 2. Okay. Now, if we divide this by this, we are left with 1, right? So what we actually have here is 2x is equal to 1 plus 1 over 2 plus log 5 divided by 2 log 2. So we have 2x is equal to Let's add 1 to half. We'll have the LCM is 2. 1 divided 2 is 2. 2 times 1 is 2. 2 divided 2 is 1. 1 times 1 is 1. Plus, then this is same thing as half multiplied by log 5 divided by log 2. We are almost at the answer then we'll prove that the answer we got is right which is the main reason why i'm shooting this video okay so looking at this we'll have 2x is equal to 2 plus 1 is 3 so we have 3 divided by 2 plus half bracket log 5 divided by log 2 yes because this is same thing as half multiplied by this, right? So when you look closely, you can see that we have half here and we can even bring out half here, okay? So we can factorize half from the right-hand side as half into... Now, when this is divided by this, we are left with 3 plus... When this is divided by this, we are left with log 5 divided by log 2. Okay? But log A over log B is equal to log A base B. So, we will have 2x is equal to half bracket 3 plus log 5 base 2. Now, at this point, we can get our x easily. And to get x, we divide both sides. 
of this equation by 2. Okay? So if we do that, we will have 2x divided by 2 is equal to half bracket 3 plus log 5 base 2 multiplied by half. Because dividing by half, by 2, is same thing as multiplying by half. All right. We are almost there. Okay. Now, 2 we remove 2 and we have x is equal to 1 times 1 is 1, 2 times 2 is 4. So what we are going to have is 1 over 4 brackets, 3 plus log 5 base 2. All right? Which is the same thing as 3 plus log 5 base 2 divided by 4. So this becomes the value of our x. Okay. Now, let us prove that the answer is correct. It's actually a very simple thing. But if you don't know some laws of log reading, you will not be able to prove the solution. Okay? All right. So, remember that we simplified this to 4 raised to the power of 2x is equal to 40. Remember. So, we now substitute the value of our x, which is this. 4 to the power of 2 bracket 3 plus log 5 base 2 divided by 4. Now, is this equal to 40? Now, 4 is equal to 2 squared. So, we are going to replace 4 with 2 squared. And we are going to raise this to the power of 2 into 3 plus log 5 base 2 divided by 4. Is this equal to 40? Now, remember that a to the power of m raised to the power of n is equal to a to the power of m times n. So it simply means that this is 2 to the power of 2 times 2, 4 brackets. 3 plus log 5 base 2 divided by 4. Is this equal to 40? So 4 we remove 4, right? If they multiply each other. So we are now left with 2 to the power of 3 plus log 5 base 2. Now, is this equal to 40? So at this point, we are going to recall a law in exponents or in indices. And this law states that a to the power of m plus n is equal to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n. Therefore, we can write this as 2 to the power of 3 multiplied by 2 to the power of log 5 base 2. Now, is this equal to 40? <laughs> now, this is where another law of log reading will set us free, okay? It's going to save us. And this law states that A to the power of M, sorry, A to the power of log B base A, okay, is equal to B. Yes. So here we have 2 to the power of 3, which is 8. So we have 8 multiplied by, then we have the same thing here and here, just like this. So it means the whole of this is 5. Is this equal to 40? Now 8 times 5 is 40, and 40 is equal to 40. That proves that we are correct. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.